Okay, um, I thought I'd... Because sometimes you just need to. Um, I'm looking at um, sample length. So, um, since Lord asked about a gentleman on um, Facebook, the length of sample that the deluge can play. Uh, so last night, one of the songs my wife and I are working on, um, we recorded some of the tracks for it. And each of these rolls is uh, basically a, a synth with the... Uh, oscillator set to uh, sample type so um, do that load the sample in and then each um, track is a waveform so that's the the waveform for the complete track uh, if you zoom in um, you'll see you can see it, it uh, stretches the what's going to play um, and what I thought I'd do I'd, I'd layer them so we've got my wife singing her, her guitar uh, got a synth type sound a bit of a lower bass sound and some other mix in the back dead simple I'll run it through and show you that you can use it like a um, to alter the levels of the uh, like a mixer and whatever else comes from it but this this sample itself is uh, going to be about six to seven minutes long I think the song is so that's how long well the video will be a bit longer <laughs> uh, but not hopefully not too much longer um, so we're gonna start off here these are as I say these are all uh, samples uh, if I go to type there's that sample um, so these are just samples I've recorded into the deluge and now I'm going to play them all synchronized up at the same time. Um, off we go. Off we go. <laughs> So there you can hear that's all of them playing at the same time. If I mute these three tracks, we'll just hear uh, my wife singing on the guitar and I'll bring these others in as it plays. Off we go. So, also with these individual layers, if I go into the level, uh, I can alter the level. I'll take the right down. This one. So you can see it can work sort of like a mixer. And you can um, oops. Uh, you, you can take the levels for all the different layers, like tracks in a mixer, I suppose, um, and, and 
alter the levels and uh, you can also bring them in and out and obviously a better way to bring them in and out would be to go into the particular track put the level right down bring the track in and then bring the level up and if you want to add effects uh, onto the top of that you can do um, we go to uh, mod effects type Now, of course, so we, the depth of the chorus. My heart is confident in you, my God. Yeah, so. Yes, I will sing and break music. I'll play my song. I'll play my song. So you can do all sorts of different things with it. That's just to show that. Um, and these are all um, the samples playing. Cut off and resonance. So there you can um, play around with those <laughs> as you want to decimate it, make it terrible. D-link the pitch and speed. song to end you can slow it right down put your reverb on we're still on speed and pitch independent
So there we are. There's a bit um, of things you can do with some uh, samples and the layers that you can have. That's just like the four samples there. Um, so I thought we'd go for uh, a look at your um, sample and how we can manipulate it in the in the next video, synth lord. So see you in a short while.